Got an 04 STI behind me. Customer's actually been complaining. He's overheated a couple times. He's put a new thermostat in it, new radiator, water pump, still overheating. He thinks he bled the cooling system good. But as we all know, every once in a while, you have to worry, did I lose a head gasket? Uh, what I'm holding is actually a CO2 tester. We're checking for combustion in the cooling system. You got two levels, you got some dye in there with a liquid dye. Overall, what it does is that I actually suck out some of the air in the cooling system and the dye will change color showing you have a head gasket leak or CO2 combustion in the cooling system. As you can see, I'm pumping it right now. It stays blue. Uh, if there's CO2 in the cooling system, this will change colors to a yellow. It also will change to green if the car is a diesel and so forth. Very universal tool, works really well. We'll go ahead and start this car up and I'll show you how it works. All right, we got our 04 STI running and we're now going to use our head gasket combustion leak tester to see if we have CO2 gases in the radiator or cooling system. So I'm going to put my beaker thing over the radiator. Uh, the coolant's down about two inches. We suck some out, so we're not going to suck coolant in this. We're going to just try to suck air. What we're looking for is that dye to change colors because of the presence of CO2 in the cooling system. And you can see this bottom one is already starting to change colors. I got four pumps in. And you'll notice that it's starting to turn a yellow, yellow in color. What we're finding is that there's the presence of CO2 gases in the cooling system. This car has had a problem with overheating and within three pumps, I'm already changing colors. I mean, this is a gross leak. I haven't even raised the RPMs. If you rev this car and really load up the engine, you'll probably find the presence of lots and lots of CO2 gases in the cooling system. Now, to show people, I'm gonna go back to normal air in the atmosphere, and this sucker should start turning back to blue because I'm aerating, as you can see, I'm aerating the air in around us, and we have less CO2 gases in, it goes back to blue. So that shows you that this is a very accurate test, that we can see CO2 in the cooling system very quickly and tell us that we have a head gasket or a combustion in the cooling system problem. Overall, what we're gonna have to do now is rip this engine apart and replace the head gaskets or look for other failures in the system. If you have any questions or you have a Subaru that's overheating or another car that's overheating, you may want to look into a quick and simple test for CO2 in the cooling system. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, go ahead and email us or call us. Email is sales at and call us. Shop numbers on the website. Have a great day.